Hi, my name is Robin Wong and I'm currently in the Kuala Lumpur Bird Park. I have only one reason to be here. I'm testing the video shooting capability of the Olympus OMD EM1 Mark III. I am not a cinematographer. I'm really new when it comes to videography. I don't really know what I'm doing when I'm shooting video. But hey, I just want to have fun. And of course, I'm testing a few features in the video shooting of the EM1 Mark III as well such as how good is the image stabilization in handling handheld video shooting and also how efficient is the autofocus in sticking to my face in this vlog as well as tracking the subjects or the birds that I'm shooting in this KL Bird Park. The lenses that I'm using for this test, there are only two lenses that I brought with me today. First one being the 40 to 150 Pro, that's the long lens that will get us close to the birds. And also for this vlogging, I'm using the Olympus 12mm f2 prime lens. I know that Olympus cameras currently are lagging behind in competition when it comes to video shooting capabilities and features. There's no 4K60 and the announced de development. The bird agrees with me. And they announced in development the Canon EOS R5 will be able to shoot 8K video. That is fantastic. However, Olympus does have some tricks up their sleeves. The stabilization is incredible. All the footage you've seen earlier, they were done handheld. I didn't use tripod, I didn't use gimbal, I didn't use any kind of stabilization equipment. I'm not saying that you don't need gimbal anymore. I'm not saying that you should be just using the camera and the 5 6 image stabilization is good enough. But for someone like me, who is not really that crazy about videography, and I do shoot video from time to time, just that not doing anything crazy with video, the 5 assist image stabilization is a lifesaver. I don't need to invest in a lot of equipment and yet I can get really steady, professional looking results. And the autofocus was incredible. Everything was shot in autofocus. I didn't do anything to the camera. I didn't do manual focus. I didn't really point to the area where I wanted to focus. I just left everything to auto. And the camera was smart enough to determine which subject to shoot. And I have very, very high hit rate that I don't have many reshoots in the video footages that I've shown you earlier. The autofocus is so reliable now that I am willing to use the autofocus for most of my video shooting. And you've seen on my vlogs and of course a lot of my videos currently in this channel, although they were not taken with EM1 Mark III, most of the videos they were taken currently with EM5 Mark III, the face recognition or the face autofocus tracking is so reliable that the camera just sticks on my face, I can just move around go away and come back and the camera will automatically find my face and locks it in place. It will stick to my, my face and it's just freaking amazing. I am probably not the best person to tell you how the video quality is, looking at the cinema 4K quality, but to my eyes, they were really sharp. The details are there. The colors are fantastic. I didn't really do any color grading. I was actually shooting in manual mode most of the time, sometimes in shutter priority, sometimes in aperture priority. I do use an ND filter to get that cinematic 1 over 50th of a second, shooting 24 frames per second. I left my white balance to auto and the picture mode that I use is actually natural. So it's in camera natural mode. And the colors and the contrast that comes out from the videos are very punchy and they look really, really pleasing. Of course, if you are in the film production, you are doing anything serious with video, the Olympus OMD system may not be suitable for you, but I think for most people, the super reliable autofocus and the super steady image stabilization are God sent. I can just turn on the camera, switch it to the video mode, start running and shooting video, and the camera will get me usable footage again and again reliably. I do think that the EM1 Mark III is an excellent vlogging camera, but hey, I prefer to use the EM5 Mark III for vlogging because the camera is so much smaller and it fits the hand better. Do let me know what you think of the video that I've shot of the Kale Bird Park and the beautiful birds here. Let me know in the comments below. If you've enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please consider subscribing to this channel and I will definitely make more videos coming this way. Until the next one, please remember to go out and take more photographs. Bye-bye.